Hi, Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. Windows 10 Update KB5005033 is now rolling out and it started rolling out yesterday on Patch Tuesday the 10th of August 2021. Now, as I mentioned in my previous video, this is an important update and in this video we will just take a bit of a more in-depth look at what this update actually entails. And it's an important update because Microsoft says it finally fixes the Prince Spooler nightmare vulnerability that has been affecting all those supported versions of Windows. Now we actually hope that this is the case because this uh, printing issue, this vulnerability has been going on now for quite some time. And what this means now, according to Microsoft, once you apply this latest patch Tuesday update, is that in order to now install printer drivers, you will have to have administrative privileges to do that. And basically this mitigates the Windows Print Spooler vulnerability that allowed um, any user to install drivers using the point and print in Windows, which could then be exploited to install you know, a mal uh, malicious drivers, which could allow for remote code execution and system privileges. So according to Microsoft, KB5005033 now is finally resolving those printing vulnerabilities. Now, the update is rolling out for Windows 10 versions 21H1, 20H2, and 20.04. And in, if you're on version 21H1, after applying the update, your OS build should be 19043.1165. If you're on 20H2, that should be 19042. And if you're on 20.04, that should be 19041. And the point release will stay the same for all three versions of Windows 10. Now, as always, the update will roll out through Windows Update. And because the update is a compulsory mandatory update, the Patch Tuesdays are always uh, compulsory and mandatory, it will be downloaded and installed automatically onto your device. And if for some reason you are having issues with that installation process through Windows Update, you can always head over to the Microsoft Update catalog. You just, install, you just uh, enter the KB number, find your relevant version of Windows 10, and you can download and install it uh, manually, which should take care of those installation issues if it cannot be installed through the Windows Update process. Now, at the end of last month, Microsoft rolled out the optional preview update, which it normally does at the end of um, every month. And in that update, there were fixes for performance and gaming issues which were caused way back from the March and April updates. And I have posted numerous videos on those issues. And those issues were mainly to do with frame rate drops and stuttering when playing games. So if you didn't install that update, which was an optional update, those fixes now will be carried over into this update, um, KB5005033. And those should now be addressed in this latest Patch Tuesday update. And another um, issue, uh, that was um, fixed in last month's optional update, if you didn't install that, which is now being carried over into this update, update, is that if you had issues with your power plans and game mode, um, then this update will address those issues. So if you were changing power plans and you were having issues, or you were in uh, using game mode, and you had issues using game mode in Windows 10, then according to Microsoft, all those have now been fixed in this latest update. And then, Obviously, it has the, um, the, the normal general bug fixes which roll out with every Patch Tuesday update. And those include fixes for the File Explorer, memory leaks, audio issues, and so on. So if you've had any you know, uh, various bug issues in Windows 10, then this update should address those issues according to Microsoft. And obviously, it also carries those all important uh, security fixes. And if we just head over to the Security Update Guard, we can see here on the 10th of August for numerous uh, Microsoft products, a whole lot of security updates were rolled out. And this update also fixes and addresses a lot of security issues that were found in the Windows operating system. And we can see the severity is important. So there are a lot of important security updates that are addressed with this latest update, KB5005033. So that's more or less what I can see is new in this latest Patch Tuesday update. So I hope you found this video useful. Once again, thanks for watching, and I will see you in the next one.